Alright, welcome back guys. Um, I want to show you a super cool way that you can add and subtract fractions with unlike denominators and that is called the butterfly method. And uh, it turns out in order uh, to use the butterfly method to add two-fourths and two-fifths together here um, I'm actually going to draw a butterfly. So one of my butterfly wings is going to be this four and two. And my other butterfly wing is going to be this two and five. And uh, well, I wouldn't have a butterfly if I didn't have a butterfly head and a couple antennas here and then also the rest of the butterfly's body and uh, so uh, we have our butterfly drawn around our problem here uh, but let's take a look at what we actually have to do to solve this problem and uh, I'm gonna start out with this wing here this 2 plus 5 wing so I'm recircling this wing here so you guys see what I'm talking about, this uh, 2 plus 5 wing here. And it turns out I'm actually going to multiply 2 and 5, and I'm going to put the answer underneath this antenna here. So 2 times 5 is 10. And uh, I'm going to move on to my other wing here. So I'm going over my second wing here uh, where the 4 and the 2 are and I'm going to multiply 4 by 2 and that's going to give me 8 and uh, so we multiplied uh, kind of diagonally here uh, but I'm going to drop down into the uh, lower parts of both wings so the lower part where I have my 4 here and my 5 here, and I'm going to multiply the 4 by 5, and I'm going to get 20, and I'm going to put my answer 20 down here in this bottom part of the butterfly. So, going back up to the top, I have 10 underneath one antenna and 8 underneath the other. Well, since this is an addition problem... So we have an addition sign here. Uh, so this addition sign is actually going to come up here. And I'm going to go ahead and write this addition sign right here in the butterfly's head here. And uh, this is, is reminding us that we're going to be adding this 10 and 8 here. We're going to be adding this 10 and 8. So 10 plus 8 is 18, and that becomes the numerator of uh, my fraction here and then uh, the 20 we got in the bottom part of this butterfly here that's going to be my denominator and so 18 twentieths is the answer to two fourths plus two fifths and I did so using the butterfly method And uh, the butterfly method works uh, just as um, just as good as um, on subtraction problems as it does on addition problems. So for our second example here, I have four fifths minus one third. And just as in the previous example, I'm going to draw a butterfly around my problem here. And so I drew my two wings, and of course I have to have a butterfly head and a couple antenna. And I finish up my butterfly by drawing the rest of its body below the wings. Alright, so I'm going to um, multiply uh, the numbers in my wings here. And it's a good thing to uh, note that um, I'm always going to be multiplying uh, the numbers that are in the wings. Uh, whether I'm adding or subtracting. So that's a good thing to remember. Alright, so 
I'm going to start with this wing here that I'm drawing over uh, this 4 and 3 here. And I'm going to multiply 4 and 3 and get 12 and write it underneath this antenna here. And then I'm going to do the same thing with the uh, 5 and 1 in this second wing that I'm drawing over. And that's going to be 5. 5 times 1 is 5, and I put the answer um, underneath this second antenna like so. And then I'm going to multiply, uh, finally, this 5 and 3 in the bottom part of the wings. And I'm going to end up with 15 down below here. And uh, so, uh, oh, and because this is a subtraction problem, so you see I'm circling my operation sign here. Um, and I'm going to move that operation sign, this minus sign, up into the head here. And um, I'm All right, and I, uh, I want to finish this video with a warning. That's why I have it in red, right? Um, so, warning. Only use the butterfly method to add and subtract fractions. If you try to use the butterfly method uh, to multiply or divide fractions, uh, you're going to get some answers you don't want to get. Uh, so please remember um, on tests and quizzes and homework um, to only use the butterfly method when you're adding and subtracting fractions. All right, guys, uh, until next time, uh, I will see you in class.